What I'm about to tell you will make an absolute difference in the way that you drive your business transformation. But before I tell you, make sure to follow so that you can see my other videos that complete what I'm telling you here. And this one is slightly longer than usual, so be sure to stick around to the end for this one because I'm going to tell you everything that you need to know about the three key elements that you need to have in place for a real transformation of your business. So for business transformation, you need three key elements to succeed. And it's all about discovering the essential tools, processes and people that are necessary for a successful business transformation so that you can achieve the results that you deserve and propel your business forward. It's like a three legged stool. If one is missing, you fall off. So you really need to focus on all three. And when you are a young online entrepreneur, you understand the importance of adapting and evolving in a rapidly changing business landscape. So to drive your business transformation successfully, it is crucial to have the right tools, the right processes and the right people in place. And in this video, I will go through the three key elements that are essential for your business transformation so you can get the desired outcomes. The right approach is based on the exact amount you need for each of these three key elements. It's all about the appropriate level for the task at hand. It's not too much and not too little. The question I always have in my mind when dealing with this is to what measure must I use this in my business, in my project, in my investment, etc. Too much and it will probably overkill and it will be unnecessary and it will lead to confusion and a lack of adoption and too little and it will not enable the desired results to be achieved. So let's look at these three key elements in more detail. One the right tools. And it's one of the fundamental aspects of a successful business transformation. It's having the right tools at your disposal, whether it's advanced software or automation system or analytics platforms. These tools can streamline your operations and enhance your efficiency and provide valuable insights. By using technology effectively, you can optimize your processes and improve decision making and as a result, drive your growth. So invest in the right tools that will cater for your specific business needs, ensuring they align with your goals and objectives. Whichever set of tools you choose, keep them simple. Not simply easy to use, but also easy to share with your team. The level of tools you need will depend on the kind of business that you are running and the kind of information that you need to share, to manage, to use based on who your customers are, but also based on who your stakeholders are or even your shareholders. You don't need highly sophisticated tools if you are a small team and are still in the early stages of development of your business. But if you have a board of directors, some investors and shareholders that you need to report to and who will expect transparency in full accountability, you better have the right gear to help you communicate to them clearly and with very much detail. So don't overkill if you don't need it, but define the level you require when it is appropriate. Now, two, the right processes. Implementing solid processes is paramount to ensuring a smooth and successful business transformation. It involves analyzing and re-evaluating your existing workflows and identifying areas that require improvement or realignment. And streamlining your processes can really help eliminate redundancies, minimize errors and increase your productivity. Clear communication and standardized procedures as well as continuous evaluation and optimization are in essential to sustainable success. So create a roadmap that outlines the necessary steps and milestones to guide your transformation journey effectively. You see, processes are meant to help you not block you. So if something is not working correctly, check where it blocks and don't hesitate to change the process so that it works for you. Again, don't forget that simple question to what measure should I apply this process to my business? Most of the time, the simpler the better. But you do need to have a process in place if you want your business to grow. Processes don't only help you understand how your business operates, they also help your team follow your set of rules to ensure everything will run smoothly and with the least possible surprises. Three, the right people. Business transformation is not a one person show. 
Surrounding yourself with the right team is vital for your success. So collaborate with individuals who share the same vision and possess the skills and expertise required to drive the transformation forward. So foster a culture of openness, innovation and continuous improvement. Encourage your team members to think outside of the box, explore new ideas and embrace change. By nurturing a supportive but dynamic environment, you can unlock the full potential of your team and fuel the transformation. So here's a simple rule for you to follow. It's not about the people you know, it's about the skills you need. So focus not on who is around you and who is available, but ensure you select the people who have the experience for the job at hand, those who have done it before and master their skill, not from a book or seeing others do it, but those who have real world experience of what you actually need. It might take you a little longer to find the right person, but you will save a lot of time and sweat and anxiety in the long run. So driving a successful business transformation requires the right tools, the right processes and the right people. I hope that you found this useful and I go through all this very much in detail in phase three of my core program from Chaos to Growth. And it's a monthly membership that you can join at any time for as long as you need. So you're welcome to join whenever you feel you're ready. And don't forget, you've got this. So keep going, keep growing. Take care.